Question 8 is all about buying a new football kit. We've got a shirt, we've got some shorts, we've got some socks. These prices that are on the tags are the same prices that's in the table. And the question is, altogether, how much does the complete football kit cost? Anytime you see the word altogether, it's basically another word for total. And if you're finding the total, it means you've got to add up the separate prices. Now, when you're adding decimals, you've got to make sure that the, you cut in your column method, you, your numbers are lined up in the correct columns. Okay, and it's one way of doing that is to actually put your decimal points in first and then build the number up around the point. So we've got 875, we've got 595, and we've got 415. Okay, and we are adding. So we've got 5 plus 5 plus 5 is 15. Put your 5 in, carry your 1. Now try and look for numbers that make 10. So we've got 1 and 9 is 10. Plus 7 is 17. Plus that 1 is 18. Put your 8 in, carry your 1. Again, try and make 10 if you can. 5 and 4 is 9. Plus that 1 and carry is 10. Plus that 8 is 18. Put your 8 in. Now we need to carry a 1, but considering there's no column left, I might as well just put that 1 straight in. Do not forget that you've got to have an, a point in your answer as well. And your point, it's easy to know where it goes because it's lined up with the other points, so we need a point in there. So our final answer looks like it is £18.85, which we just need to write in there. The only thing I could have said extra is that those of you who have been observant, we could have actually used this table here because they're already lined up. So we could have actually just put a space for our answer at the bottom and gone straight away and did it again. 5 plus 5 plus 5 is 15. 1 and 9 is 10. Plus 7, 17. Plus 1 is 18. 5, 4 and 1 is 10. Plus 8 is 18. Put your 8 in, carry your 1. So you could have actually done it straight from the table. Total amount, £18.85.